Abu Dhabi and I am in the uh, tourist club which is a very old area of Abu Dhabi and you can see behind me all the buildings when you travel or when you move to a new country you have to try the local flavor or you have to try the local food so I found a restaurant that I think is good but uh, they don't have what I like so I looked at the menu and I was after a uh, mutton palak but they don't have any palak and palak is uh, spinach if I'm correct and then the second thing that I wanted was um, paneer like paneer masala the one that I eat all the time but again they didn't have that so I'm going to give it a try so here we are so it's called the Dallas restaurant I didn't actually pay attention to it but Dallas being where your cousins are from but it's definitely not Tex-Mex it's more Indian as you can see and it's very local so what they had as you can see well you can't really see because it's really small but here they have a um, they have a mutton palak right but they don't have any palak and so now I'm going to look for something to eat in that section there which is the vegetables all right so we're gonna go inside and we're going to investigate the first thing that you can see and this is why I came to eat here is that the kitchen is right there and it's clean so as long as the kitchen is clean then uh, it's safe to eat here and the second thing that I looked for was a washroom to make sure that you can clean your hands and as you know you always have to clean your hands before you eat anything so here we have a washroom so it's sort of it's safe for me to eat here and I think that it would be quite good so I don't know if you can see anything but basically here you have all the vegetables and uh, I have never tried I've never tried the gopi Manchurian so I have no idea what a gopi Manchurian is and I have no idea what a bindi masala is and here's another gopi Manchurian. So this is Manchurian with a G, and this is Manchurian with a CH. So uh, I have no idea what these are. Now these two here are chilies. All right. So we will avoid the chili, and I think that the best bet, the best bet for me, will be to go for bindi masala. And if worse comes to worse, the next thing that I can have is an omelette prata. Now you can see the prices are really affordable, like three dirham, that's like a dollar. That's one US dollar. So an omelette prata for one dirham is very affordable. For one dollar, sorry, is very affordable. And this one, this one is what I was after, that, but I don't think they have it. All right, let's order and see what happens. Now, one thing, one thing that they do sometimes in uh, in restaurants is, if you ask for tea, they're gonna bring you tea in this cup there. Uh, now, this is styrofoam, uh, and it's not the healthiest for your health. It's not good. It's once you put hot water in it, uh, it's not really good for your health. So I try to avoid, avoid it. And uh, what I do is I transfer the tea in the glass, which is not, you know, it's not very acceptable in some restaurants that you put a tea in, in glass because then they have to wash it and it's not water. Uh, but in this case, I prefer to take care of what I drink and the cup I drink in it. You know, I prefer to take care of that rather than uh, upset a few people with what I drink it in. I'm going to put this as I always do. I'm going to put this in my uh, in my curry or uh, in this case the gopi the gobi masala. Look at the kitchen and you can see it's pretty cool. 
I've got all the food there ready and available. So, um, yeah. And the chaps are very kind, very nice, so perfect choice. Okay, so this is a gopi masala with a chapati here. Chapati is cold actually, it's not hot. So what I've done is I've put the cucumber in the dish to uh, heat them up. And as I was heating them up, I found out that masala, as you know, is the curry, curry masala, all of that. And gopi is actually like uh, cauliflower or broccoli or broccoli that you can eat. And it comes with a bit of sauce and that's about it. So I guess you just wrap up your um, your um, chapati and you just roll it up and eat it. So I'll talk to you after I'm done. All right, so I have to go really low because the camera is really low. So you have your chapati here. And just take it up. And um, okay, that's fairly big. And then you just pick up your cauliflower and you eat it. The point, the point is this, you can travel anywhere around the world and you can definitely spend a lot of money on eating, but if you're not afraid of the local culture, or if you're not afraid of the local food, Abu Dhabi is very cheap, you can actually eat very cheap food and be very healthy. And if you love food, then Abu Dhabi can give you access to very delicious, cheap food. But you just have to try to take a risk. Mm -hmm. It's interesting, the guy behind me is drinking Coke. I mean, why would you drink Coke when you can have so there you have it. Dinner at the Dallas restaurant. Not very close to Texas, but definitely delicious.